So I'm in the line at Dunkin' Donuts this morning and I'm talking with the cashier. And she's telling me about a fight that happened at the women's NIT game that I forgot to report on Thursday night. So I'm going to tell you about it today. After Bowling Green's 73-60 win over Memphis in the round of 16 of the women's NIT tournament, Memphis player Jamira Schutz, Falcons player Alyssa Brett seem to get into it as they're shaking hands. A couple of words were exchanged. Schutz throws a punch. Brett falls into the scorer's table and on the ground. Schutz players pull her off the court. And it's all, it's all ugly, just an ugly situation. Ugly end to what seemed to be a pretty good basketball game, maybe, I don't know, 13 points is maybe not great, I guess it just depends, but anyway, that's not the story, Jameer Schutz is now being charged with assault, and you just hate for it to end like this, I mean, she was second team all conference, she averaged 24 points a game, and to just go out like that, in your final college game, like, you don't want to be remembered like that, I think sometimes we as competitors, we pour our hearts and souls into this game, and when it doesn't turn out in our favor, the outcome that is, you know, it gets a little heated. You know, words were exchanged, but you got to keep your composure in a situation like that. You have to keep your composure. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Should Jamira be charged? Uh, how should the NCAA handle this? How should the teams handle this moving forward? And let me get your thoughts. I'm Rico McGee. This has been the Sports Minute. And as always, we'll see you in a minute.